Nina Gilles. Thank you, President. High Representative, no one should face persecution or discrimination because of who they are and whom they love. However, from the 3rd of April in Brunei, as we've heard, is the case. When it implemented Sharia law, including death by stoning, amputation of limbs and other forms of corporal and capital punishment, these laws didn't come about because there was a public demand, but because the regime is unpopular. Its economy is failing. These measures were there to distract from the real issues affecting the people of Brunei. Therefore, it is critical that the European Union takes effective measures that condemn these barbarous practices, including targeted visa ban for the regime and even sanctions against the businesses owned by the Sultan. Our objective must be to ensure that these draconian measures aren't implemented and that they can only, that can only happen if there is international condemnation but also through political dialogue with stakeholders both inside and outside. High Representative, we need to stop being appalled. We need to act on these urgency. And finally, can I just say also to colleagues, this may be my last speech and I'd like to thank everybody for their cooperation.